The general manager, or the GM, he's responsible for player contract negotiations, talent evaluations, managing the minor league farm system, making sure that the right people are called up at the right time to play in the show. Um, the general manager is the guy that has the one-on-one -on -one negotiations with the player agents into determining who's going to be allowed to go free agency, what free agents they're going to be allowed to bring in, um, what players they're going to retain. He has to manage the entire organization. He has to oversee the front office personnel as well as the on the field staff. So he's got a lot of responsibilities and a very important job. You don't necessarily see him actively in the game, though in our modern uh, incarnation of baseball, especially with free agency as prominent as it is, we see and hear more about the general manager than we once did. Uh, Brian Cashman um, for the New York Yankees, Theo Epstein uh, for the Boston Red Sox, John Sherholtz for the Atlanta Braves, uh, who recently uh, retired from that role. These are synonymous with the game of baseball. If you, you say their names, most baseball fans know who they are just as easily as Roger Clemens or Manny Ramirez or Chipper Jones. Uh, the GM, again, determines everything about the team. He puts the team in a singular direction on every level from the front office staff to the on-field staff and the talent, talent evaluation staff. Um, so he's got a very important job um, primarily fielding the right team to um, get the team where it needs to be.